Hey, welcome back to WiseWorks Studio. Today, we're gonna to be reacting to the Iron Claw official trailer. It's got Jeremy mm -hmm. Allen White, it's got Zac Efron, and yep. a couple other big names, but I'm excited. We've been kind of talking about this for a minute, waiting for this trailer to drop, and it's well, finally We've been seeing dropped. Zac Efron yeah. on steroids. Some on the roids, on the action. big chin, on the Zach doing <laughs> crazy things for this role. Um, but we did compare his physique on the podcast to mm -hmm. the actual um, man that he is representing. And so it's very similar. So yeah, very I'm excited similar. to see this trailer. Let's go ahead and watch it. We'll yeah. give our thoughts after. So stick around. Here we go. Ever since I was a child, people said my family was cursed. It's huge. Mom tried to protect us with God. Pop tried to protect us with wrestling. He said if we were the toughest, the strongest, nothing had ever hurt us. I like this sequence. I yeah, believed it. Cool. We all did. Morning. Pants <laughs> tomorrow, please, David. Oh, Harry, I want you to join your brothers in the ring. Yes, sir. I love that. <laughs> now, we all know. Carrie's my favorite, then Kev, then David, then Mike. But the rankings can always change. What do you want in life, Kevin Von Eric? More ribs. <laughs> I want to be with my family. You know, be with my brothers. What do you like to do with your brothers? Risk. Oh, man. Together. It's going to be a great movie. movie. We're here to restore justice to the wrestling federation that our father built with his own two hands. The hands that were passed down to us. The hands that will deliver the iron clock to you. So what do you think? Wow. Like we're alive. I love we, your family. Jeremy, you. thank you. Mm. Don't we, uncle? Yes, sir. Oh, man, that makes me so happy. I talked to you about something. Dad's too tough on us. You gotta say something. Baby, that's what your brothers are for. You feel that? Ah. You feel that? Ah. That's pressure. I mean, you're pushing too hard. I'm fine, Kev. Seriously, I'm just sick. Got a little scared, man. It all out of control. That's a terrible accident. I should have stopped him. Yeah. I need to think about my family. Your job is to wrestle. Live up to that deal, or we are through. I told you to look out for him! I just love being out there with you guys. It's the only thing that matters to me. The Bonner will forever be the greatest family in the history of wrestling. <laughs> nice. Uh, that actually looks like a really good movie. Oh my gosh, yes. That looks so freaking good. Yeah. Just like Dominic Toretto said, and now Zac Efron, it's all about family. <laughs> right, right. Yeah, I'm gonna look this up on on IMDb. Yeah, I yeah. Get, look up all the brothers because we're, we're showing a lot of light to Jeremy and Zach. Zach but Efron. There's also yeah, two you other got, brothers. Uh, Harris uh, Harris Dickinson. Um, okay, who's playing the son David? Uh, a woman named Doris, I believe that might be the mom of the family. It looks like the father of the family is uh, Holt McLean. Okay. And um, you got Lily James, who looks like she's playing the love interest oh, for yeah. Zach Efron's character. Mm -hmm. And she's been in other things. I think the last thing I saw her in, was it Downton Abbey? Maybe. Uh, might have been Downton Abbey. Yeah, Lily she's, James. Been in, she's been in quite a few things because I've seen her too. Um, but yeah. I, this looks uh, it, it looks when really that, that moment that moment when all when they're like so what are you like doing with your brothers and then all three of them just like jump into the ring and start mm -hmm. fighting and yeah I, I know it's i know it's not nacho libre but it gave me some nacho libre vibes <laughs> a little bit yeah <laughs> it was kind of I mean, fun you know i i'm i've never been a big fan of the, like wwe wrestling but mm -hmm. i'm excited for this movie i think they everything they've done for this movie in preparation of like the brothers and how they worked out Jeremy getting big, Zach getting big, um, right. like physically they, they worked out a lot for this role to get into the physique physique they needed to. And then, right. you know, the, I guess like seventies, eighties vibe that they they're mm -hmm. in, I guess it's more seventies than eighties, but 
the seventies vibe that this movie is ha- has is yeah. really nostalgic, and I just I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah, and um, and, you know, with the the pro wrestling genre, I think is gaining a little bit more interest in culture. Mm-hmm. I see it, I see it around more often um, these days. And it almost was for the longest time very popular, obviously, but in a in a niche group of people that just kind of kept yeah. it popular. Now I feel like it's branching out and there there's interest around it. Like I feel like there's a renewed interest in, in fighters that have retired like Ric mm-hmm. Flair, you know, or, um, or Hulk Hogan. And, and, uh, and so, yeah, I think this is, this is fun. This is like, this is, this is not only respecting a sport, but it's mm-hmm. respecting a family and the story there, and yeah. then respecting this family's lineage in this sport. So I think it's and you know who better than say what you will about Zac Efron and his his recent cosmetic changes. I'm not talking about steroids. There, he's a great actor. Yeah. It, if he if he would. Honestly, I think a lot of people would think of Zac Efron in the same vein of someone like a Jake Gyllenhaal, you know what I mean, as far as skill level, yeah. if he wasn't in High School Musical. That's yeah, kind of tarnished his reputation. He definitely got right. typecasted. Right. And, and, uh, but he's a brilliant actor. You can see it in his eyes. You can see it in his performances. And, um, and obviously... Jeremy Allen White is brilliant oh, yeah. as well. Uh, he's going to go a long ways, but he's like he's like one of those pure artists. He's yeah. He, you're not going to be able to typecast him because he's he's too uh, he's too good at the craft. So um, I'm real excited to see this. I'm excited to see the younger of the the three. I guess so mm-hmm. you get to know uh, Harris Dickinson. I, what I don't know what other roles he's been in. Um, it looks like maybe. Didn't he, one of them yeah, play he's been in. Um, the Rocket Man? They played in Rocket Man, I think. Or hmm. um, was it they the father played, like, played the Beatles Rocket or Man something? Or something? No, no, the I brothers. I'm, I'm pretty sure. I don't see that anywhere. Uh, yeah, I don't. I, I, it, I'm guessing it'd be Harris Dickinson. I'm not. I don't see mm-hmm. that anywhere. But um, but it's it's possible. I uh, I'm looking forward to see him in this work. Mm-hmm. I haven't seen his work before, so um, this is gonna be fun. As I was saying before we started rolling, A24 is putting out some real bangers. A24 with, uh, is doing some some stuff lately. Yeah, yeah. Are they they're the ones who did. Are they doing the uh, Priscilla movie? I think that- so. I think so. But they did like the whale that whale, came out right. with um, Brennan Fraser recently. And yeah. they've done quite a few things that are just really good. Yeah, they're like let let's just let's just uh, send everyone a big wave of mm-hmm. high quality films. You know what yeah. I mean? And uh, and there are a lot of a lot of biopics or a lot stories. of biopics. Yeah. Um, let us know what you guys think. If you think this looks like something that you're going to thoroughly enjoy, if you've been waiting mm-hmm. on this. Are you disappointed in anything? Let us know in the comments below. Uh, we really appreciate you watching. Yep. Subscribe to the channel and like this video. And if you're interested in Patreon, go check out our Patreon. Links mm-hmm. in the description. We'll see you all in the next reaction. Mm-hmm.